you know, I hope y'all can't hear nothing in the background, but good morning, good afternoon, good evening, family. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the mental house with me, your host, Khadija. I'm back, and I'm back, and I am hoping that all of y'all are safe, keeping y'all selves well. Um, cause y'all, as you know, we are in the belly of the beast and it is no stopping this devil now. You already know, the demonic forces have pretty much, um, uh, uh, taken over America, so to speak. And you have to really, really, con um, really, really concentrate your efforts to find some like-minded quality people. Because you're living in a situation where... Uh, most people, especially the dominant society, especially the dominant society, they regard money as their God. And so some of us, and when I say us, that means people of you, people who at one time uh, valued principles and valued the self and the spirituality of their existence, um, we knew that at some point, Money was not, while we love to have it, it was not what we worshipped. Um, today that's different. Because we got a lot of people that look just like me and they worship the dollar too. Okay? So, with that being said, these four judges have uh, just thrown this state into chaos. I mean, they just thrown it into deadly chaos. Um, the Supreme Court um, ruled that there were no requirements, <laughs> no regulations, and basically, as far as I'm concerned, took the power away from the governor to do his job, okay? Basically, took the power away from the governor. Hold on, y'all. Took the power away from Tony Evers to do what he needs to do, um... Uh, so they can do what they want to do, and that is run ramshot over the American people. Now, some people have asked me about the Article 25. Um, and I'm saying because the dominant society hates to really uh, make a move on their own unless it's really egregious or unless you really have people with heart like a John Brown or a Father Grappi or just... A father flagger. I mean, unless you've got, got white people at the helm that really, really, really know what's going on and are willing to put their lives on the line, it's the same uh, as usual in America. Wash, rinse, repeat. Wash, rinse, repeat. Same shit, different day. So what I'm suggesting is to all my folk, people who have a semblance of brain, don't go outside. Don't allow them to rush you into a situation where you are trying to um, basically kill yourself and your family. I don't know. I don't have all the answers. I don't have all the answers. But I know if you can get 10 people to believe with you, then that's 10 people strong than you are to gather together and make these fists. You understand what I'm saying? Because that's all you need. To start the, to fire. What's going on here is just ridiculous. And there are some people that are, I've seen them already sitting in the bars. Because their privilege won't allow them to respect the fact that the coronavirus is bigger than their whiteness. So they would rather think that everybody is trying to humiliate and hinder them. As opposed to, as opposed to them really... No one and thinking that they're just going to be inconvenienced for a while. They can't handle it. It's too much. Too much, too much, too much. Well, I contend those of y'all who got to go to the bars and got to go to restaurants and got to keep going. Keep going. Keep going. And with that being said, you're probably going to be the spike in the, case, in the cases that go up because you don't got enough damn sense that God gave you to know to keep your ass at home and to do something different. So y'all need to pray for everybody that got a governor um, that's ridiculous. 
and honor the people that got a government like Tony Evers who tried to do the right thing. Who tried? Leave me. Come here. Who tried to do the right thing before the American public? For the and for the public. Okay. Um. I have a grandchild that's here right now. She's doing the work. She's not just at home running around running the muck. She's doing the ABC mouth and the other um, uh, 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 educational toys and uh, I mean learning apparatus that she can get her hands on. We got to understand that this is important people. Some of us don't have computers. Those of us that are blessed to reach a hand out and help somebody learn. Help somebody stay on top of what's going on. Um, if you're doing it virtual, that's just as good as being there. But at the end of the day, we got to start realizing that we all we got. We all we got. So with that being said, if you like what you hear, please like, subscribe, to share. Glad to be back, you guys. To our channel. To our channel. And we'll see you next time in the mental house. Bye-bye. In the mental house. Bye. Bye-bye. I'm going to do it like this. La, 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 la. Okay.